they were always on time. They were always never late. They never spoke back when they were insulted. They worked. They never took days off that were not on the calendar. They never were on strike without permission. They worked ten days a week and were only paid for five. They worked, they worked, they worked, and they died. They died broke. They died owing. They died never knowing what the front entrance at the first national city bank looks like. Juan me Gel Milago Sol Manuel all that yesterday will die again tomorrow. Passing their bill collectors onto the next of kin. All die waiting for the God of Eden to open up again under a new management. All died, hey, dreaming about America, waking them up in the middle of the night, screaming, Mira, mira, you have uh, won uh, a ticket for uh, $100,000. <laughs> <laughs> All died. Hitting the grocery stores that sold them make believe steak and bulletproof rice and beans. <laughs> wow. All die waiting, dreaming and hating. Dead Puerto Ricans who never knew they were Puerto Ricans, who never took a coffee break from the Ten Commandments to kill, kill, kill the landlords of the cracked skull and communicate with their Latino soul. Juan Miguel Milagros, Olga Manuel, from the nervous breakdown streets with the mice live like millionaires, and the people do not live at all. They are dead and were never alive. Juan died waiting for his number to come again. Miguel died waiting for the welfare check to come and go again. Miguel died waiting for our ten children to grow up and work so she could quit working. We all got died waiting for a five dollar a raise in my well, he died waiting for his supervisor to drop debt. So he's a better promotion. <laughs> <laughs> it's a long ride from the Spanish Harlem to Long Island Cemetery where they were buried. First the train, and then the bus, and the coal cuts for lunch, and the flowers that will be stolen with visiting hours are over. It's very expensive, very expensive. But they understood, their parents understood. It's a long, long hard ride from Spanish Harlem to Long Island Cemetery. Juan Miguel Milagros, Olga, Manuel, all died yesterday today and will die again tomorrow. Dreaming, dreaming about uh, Queens and uh, clean cut little white neighborhoods and Puerto Rican scenes, $30,000 homes, the first picks on the block to belong, proud to belong to a, a community of gringos who want them lynched. Proud to belong, this is the way from the sacred praise. Oh yeah, hey, get back. <laughs> These dreams, these empty dreams from the make-believe bedrooms their parents left them are the aftermath of television programs about the ideal white American family with a black maid and Latino janitors who are well trained to make everyone and their bill collectors laugh at them and the people they represent. One, he died dreaming about a new car. He began to die dreaming about new anti-poverty programs. He began to die dreaming about a trip to Puerto Rico. Olga died dreaming about, hey, real jewelry. Emmanuel died uh, uh, dreaming about the Irish Swiss. They all died like a hero sandwich dies in the common district at 12 o'clock in the afternoon. Hey, social security, hey, to dust, and union dust, to dust. They knew they were born too weak and keep the poor teachers employed as long as they pledge allegiance to the flag that wanted them destroyed. Hey, they were trained to turn the other way, the other cheek by newspapers and misspell, uh, mispronounce, misunderstood their names and celebrated when death came and stole their finally, final long to be taken. They were born dead and they died dead. Juan Miguel Milagro Sola Manuel all died yesterday today and will die again tomorrow, hating, fighting, stealing, broken windows from each other, practicing a religion without a roof, the Old Testament, the New Testament, according to the Gospel of the Eternal Revenue, the judge and jury, an executioner, protector, an eternal bill collector, second hand shit for sale. Learn how to say, oh boy, shall we say?
and you will make a fortune. They are dead. They are dead. They will not return from the dead until they stop neglecting the art of the dialogue for broken English lessons to impress the mistress to keep them employed as lava plateau, porters, messenger boys, factory workers, maids, staff, clerks, shilling clerks, clerks, assistant, assistant, the assistant, assistant, the assistant, assistant. <laughs> Artificial smiling doorman for the lowest wages of the ages and raise will you demand a raise because it was against their company policy to promote sticks. Sticks, sticks. One guy hitting me in because he gives used power in better running condition. And Miguel died hitting Milagro because Milagro had a color TV and he could not afford one yet. And Milagro died hitting <coughs> Olga because Olga made five dollars more on the job. Olga died hitting Manuel because Manuel had hit the numbers more times than she had hit the numbers. And Manuel, he died hitting all of them. Juan, Miguel, Milagro, and Olga because they all spoke broken English more fluently than he did. <laughs> <laughs> and they now are together in the main lobby of the void, addicted to silence, off limits to the wind, confined to world supremacy in Long Island Cemetery. This is a groovy hereafter a Protestant collection but have talked so much and loud about. Here lies Juan, here lies Milagro, here lies Miguel, here lies Olga, here lies Manuel, who died yesterday today. They will die again tomorrow, always broke, always owing, never knowing that they are beautiful people, never knowing the geography of their complexion. Puerto Rico is a beautiful place. Y Puerto Rican, you say, we're a beautiful race. Mm -hmm. yeah. 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 have turned off the television and turned their own imagination. If only they had used the white supremacy Bible for toilet paper purpose <laughs> and made their Latino soul the only religion of their race. If only they had returned to the definition of the sun and the first mental snowstorm on the summer of this sentence. If only they had kept their eyes open at the funeral of their fellow employees who came to this country to make a fortune and were buried without underwears. Juan Miguel Milagro Solga Manuel will right now be in their own thing where beautiful people sing and dance and work together where the wind is a stranger to miserable weather conditions where you do not need a dictionary to communicate with your people aquí se habla español aquí you salute your flag first aquí there are no down so commercials aquí everybody smells good aquí TV dinners do not have a future mm. hey whoa Aquí, the men and women of my desire and never get tired of each other. Aquí, que pasa? Power is what that is. Aquí, to be called Negrito <laughs> is to be called with love. Mm. Punto. Yeah. Punto. Thanks for our sponsors. I want everybody to take